Grand Theft Auto 5 is the game rated M by the ESRB. Hello everyone and welcome back to more GTA 5. There's a lot of stuff going on. Hey dad, how's it going? How are you? It's so majorly weird writing to you like this. It's like a 90 something email. Wow. We have to, we'll do this, but just one way or through. Our love is be a beautiful flower that grows out sh the shit. Yes, we're gonna call that in a second. Um, I don't want to call it. I only get sad. And then afterwards, I was just thinking, I mean, you don't need to do need to know about that. Miss you. I think we all do. Sort of. Fabian is so annoying. If I want to do yoga, I'd like to go to India or something. And he keeps asking me to uh, call him dad. I'm only joking. See, I do have a sense of humor. My singing and dancing are that go are going well, but I'm really pissed that he screwed up fame or shame for me. Such a dick. Jimmy is useless. I wonder how him and I could come from the same place. Was Bone doing cook again when she was pregnant with me? Joker, was it? Anyway, we're all fine. Don't get such a don't get a divorce. That would suck. I much prefer watching you two scream and fight. It's great and what I know. Miss you, look Tracy. P.S. Do you like the spelling of my name? I think it's cute. Tracy. Anyways, yeah, let's, um, let's call him a Dr. Freelander. Hello? Dr. Isaiah Friedlander speaking. Hey, Doc, it's me. Michael, how are you? Not good, Doc. Not good at all. Well, we spent a lot of time over the years discussing how negative actions lead to negative thoughts as much as the reverse. Because of the compounding of your classical low self-esteem with your... Assorted sexual hang-ups, the desperate search for the easy answer in life, and your profound narcissism, reality will have a habit of handing you a repeated kicking. Anyway, what's up? Hell, Doc, you put mm -hmm. it like that, I'm afraid I ain't got much hope. Have you been acting out again, Michael? <sighs> Things are bad, Doc. Really bad. Tell me all about it. Sharing is winning. I'm out in the desert now, Doc. My wife left me, my kids. Oh, Christ, we upset some guy, but that wasn't enough. We stole his wife. Now we gotta leave town. I'm living in a trailer with my psycho old buddy Trevor. He keeps killing people, Doc. You know, shit, me too, but... Ah, oh, Christ, things are just really fucked up again. You've gotta make more time for therapy, Michael. This is a major relapse. Any other violent outburst, Michael? Yeah, I mean, I've had good days, Doc, but... Mostly they've just been really bad days. They're doing really bad things, you know, hurting people. You're a very sick man, Michael. I'm doing all I can, but we need more sessions. There's a part of me, Doc, I just can't seem to control. Hmm. What about your sexual problems, Michael? I've been well. I mean, I've had thoughts, but I've been good. Not a single problem. We all have thoughts, Michael. Not acting on them is real progress. Ever since I pulled that house apart, Doc, I ain't been myself. Not at all. You know, therapy can really help you, Michael, which is why you should be really pleased with what you're doing. But I'm gonna have to stop you there. Oh, and there is one thing. Phone sessions are a little more expensive, obviously. Obviously. But so fulfilling. Let's speak again soon.
that guy! Now put him up! Oh, it's you? What are you idiots up to, huh? Мы здесь защищаем честь Америки. Это предназначено судьбою. Гордая страна, которая может совершить геноцид и назвать это волью Божьей. Fella can't speak two words of English, but he knows this is the best country. Jesus! Hey, hey, what's that? The illegals ruining the place. Come on, come on, let's go. Let's, let's go. Get in. Get in. Rachen. You still got that stun gun? Oh, good man. Always prepared. Oh, oh, the depths all troll for 500 bucks. You too are completely loco. If you'll forgive my use of Spanish, you do know what that means, right? You spout all this hippie nonsense, but I know you're a patriot, Trevor. I can just tell by looking at you. Okay, get me a cloud so I can incapacitate him humanely. <laughs> Adios, amigo! Hey, civil... Border Patrol, keep your hands where I can see them. This is a citizen's arrest. Not you lunatics again. You could have killed me. Get in a vehicle now, sir. Dvigai, Dvigai. Okay, okay. Christ alive. No! Good work, boys. <laughs> now head for the cement factory. We got reports of more illegals working over there. Where are you taking me? This is a kidnapping. This is time for you to go home to Mexico, sir. What are you talking about? This is my home. I have my papers right here. Oh, yeah? Well, let me see that. Oops. His rook выскочили. You won't get away with this. I report you. <laughs> you want to report me? <laughs> Are you sure this old man's a threat to American freedom? Sure as I've ever been about anything. Jesus, you're a real fuckwit. How'd you get your hands on this patrol car? Uh, I'm a proud park ranger, my friend. A trained security professional. Step on it, Trevor! Well, now that's an admission of guilt if I ever saw one. Probably cartel members or child molesters. Haven't you got anything better to do? What, than protect our country? No. We're just stepping in where the government has failed. I'm a big supporter of President Lawton, but he's gone soft on the key issues. Everyone's so damn worried about the Hispanic vote these days. I voted for Lawton. You freak? Well, you say anything, won't you, freak? We'll come back for him. Don't let the other one get away. Darn it, beauty! Civil Border Patrol, run and I'll put you down again. You understand me? Okay, okay. Let's go, buddy. You're coming with us. Yeah, yeah, underlay, underlay. Come on, move. In the vehicle now. I said move or I will zap you again. I'm getting in, okay? Crazy assholes. All right, fellas, well, let's go back for the other one. I thought I had an arrest. 
unconditional hatred for my fellow men. Hey, but you two are something else. Please, I have a family. Well, that ain't my problem, sir. You've outstayed your generous welcome offer to you by these here United States. What? I have a visa. It's in my passport at my house. Well, you exploited the cracks in the system. Look, I have nothing against you, uh, personally. I'm not saying you can't come here for a vacation. You know, I went to Mexico once. I hated it, but I didn't try to stay there and infiltrate society and subvert the local culture. Uh, I wonder, do you have a lot of success with women? Ты арестован за преступление против демократии. What? Go car, go now. Okay. Jesus. Двигай, или я тебя заставлю двигаться. Go, go, fucker, go. Take it easy. I'm going. I'm going. Ah. Oh. Good work, everyone. Thanks for the help, Trevor. You're a fine patriot. We'll take it from here. Out of the car, citizen. That's an order. You're impeding national security, boy. We made Uncle Sam proud today. I, sober as can be. I'm a sober sociopath. I'm. I'm a sober sociopath. I'm a sad, sober sociopath. I'm a sad and silly sober sociopath.
Oh, nice place you got here. Oh, yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking <laughs> easy. But uh, this, this here is my place. And my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get the point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. Got yeah, news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure, morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic, somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen, I'm sorry, but we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to, uh, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. Thank God I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. A boat, tandem rotor heavy lift helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. And my psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made, honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend $2 million on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. Sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we gotta go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye-bye. Ah, oh, Jesus. Fucking Christ. All right. I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on. You're driving us up to the bank. Okay. All right, let's do it. Wish I could change my clothes. Go to Polito Bay. Can do. I'm calling Lester. What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. Alrighty. Alright, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, first thing you do is call the hospital and tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. Oh, this Hayseed Bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, and meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Oh, have you? Really? Yes, I <laughs> have. People always try to label you. You know, yep, I remember this maniac, conversation. psycho, friend, industry leader. Well, in some ways, you defy categorization. But then, what? Think about it. Where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. 
Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, T. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? <laughs> you are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. We do. What I really fucking do. Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. <laughs> because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers. You're gentrifying. Soon? The skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes, and then the bankers. And you'll be somewhere else, starting the cycle all over again. Maybe you're not a classic garden variety Hello hipster, there. but you're what the hipsters aspire to be. You, Trevor, are the proto-hipster. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I don't agree with what you're saying. You're talking bullshit. You're trying to wind me up. But I'm very, very angry, and I want this conversation to stop right away. Hipster. <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you, Michael! <laughs> say it again. That made my point. I'm not a sadist. Ah, uh, that is definitely one of my favorite conversations in the entirety of the game. The bus stops up here. All right. How long does it take us to get out here from LS? One of the best missions ever. Or conversations ever. Come on, man, knock it off. What? I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey. 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 Welcome to paradise. Come on, car's this way. It's dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Oh. <laughs> Shall we? Might as well get started. <sighs> Alrighty. Drive us to the bank. This is a fun heist. I will go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> oh. That's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. It'll take us around back. Okay. Talk to the lot next door. There's an empty lot behind, and no one should pay attention to us back there. I like it. Oh, yeah, I the see place what is saying. remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This will do. Let's check out the alarm to be sure. Mm hmm. It's not ideal. It's going to cost more to break that system than the score is going to pay. Well, we're going to have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no, no. This is the score. Right? What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey! You heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. This is silence, right? I want a silence gun. Okay, I brought my police scanner. I drive over to the gas station opposite the bank, and we'll... And we'll monitor chatter. All right. This 
Was that Michael? They've dispatched four cars in 60 seconds and more on standby. And it isn't even 30 Victor of shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Polito Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Hi. Cops in this county are dirty. And the alarm just went off on their piggy bank. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Yeah, four cars, more in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many, we can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Hey! Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass! Well, I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. <sighs> Race Trevor to his office. <laughs> That we can do. I shouldn't have come. I should have known. We're fine. We're gonna get out of here. Trevor Phillips, of course this would turn into a car chase. We're not being chased. Not yet. Not at all. Look, take a deep breath. We're gonna be fine. We just gotta get back to... Get off the road up here. This must be Trevor's route through the mountains. Uh, dirt track. Might get bumpy. Trevor's office? When Trevor says office, he really means... A burnout gas station by the Alamo Sea? I've seen the title of ownership, and judging by the glassware he ordered a year ago, I'm guessing it's a meth lab. A meth lab! Just perfect! Laboratory don't do it justice. It's more of a shithole where meth is made. <laughs> Nothing like a pharmaceutical bakery to prep the perfect stick-up job. Don't worry. It's gonna be fine. Look, you had any ideas about the bank? No. Are you sure we can't disable the alarm? The alarm is a UXVF 111 classification, minute long relay interval, third party verification, multiple monitoring centers. Sure, I can disable it. But? But it'll cost more than the job is worth. Of course it will. Excuse me. Of course it will. So, what do we do? We walk away. It's not like we need the money. Uh, about that. You been day trading? No, God no. I mean, yeah, 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 I've been trading, but no, that's not why we need the money. Then why do you need the money? <laughs> All right, so, there's this research laboratory on the coast. The IAA are using it to manufacture a poison gas that they're gonna release on U.S. soil in order to hope that the government increases their funding. Looks like the road takes a dip and a turn after that bridge. Slow down. Looks like the road takes a dip and a turn after that bridge. Slow down. Well, that sounds idiotically improbable. Probably I don't know to be what possible. that sound what's it was. What's to do with you and Trevor sticking Oh, no! Shit! Blaine County Savings and Loan. Agent Steve Haynes needs two million plus to finance a raid on the land. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> ah, I love that luster scream. Oh, that was the greatest thing ever. Hey, wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass. I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. Oh my God. I shouldn't have come. I should have known. We're fine. We're gonna get out of here. I get to hear that old conversation Phillips. again. Of course, this would turn into a car chase. We're not being chased. 
Not yet. Not at all. Look, take a deep breath. We're gonna be fine. We just gotta get back to Trevor's office. When Trevor says office, he really means... Get off the road up here. This must be Trevor's route through the mountains. Uh, dirt track. Might get bumpy. A burnout gas station by the Alamo Sea? I've seen the title of ownership, and judging by the glassware he ordered a year ago, I'm guessing it's a meth lab. <laughs> Fucking a meth lab. Just perfect. Laboratory don't do it. Hey! Don't do it justice. It's more of a shithole where meth is made. Great! Nothing like a pharmaceutical bakery to prep the perfect stick-up job. Don't worry. It's gonna be fine. Look, you had any ideas about the bank? Are you sure we can't disable the alarm? The alarm. The alarm is a UXVF 111 classification. A terrible driver. long relay interval. Third uh, party city car through this Multiple range. monitoring centers. Sure, I can disable it. But? But it'll cost more than the job is worth. Of course it will. So, what do we do? We walk away. It's not like we need the money. Uh, about that. You been day trading? No, God no. I mean, yeah, 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 I've been trading, but no, that's not why we need the money. Then why do you need the money? <laughs> All right, so, there's this research laboratory on the coast. Looks like the road takes a dip and a turn after that bridge. Slow down. The IAA are using it to manufacture a poison gas that they're gonna release on U.S. soil in order to hope that the government increases their funding. Well, that sounds idiotically improbable enough to be possible, but what's it got to do with you and Trevor sticking up the Blaine County Savings and Loan? Agent Steve Haynes needs two million plus... ...to finance a raid on the lab. And guess who's doing the raid? And guess who's paying for it? Ah, I see. Yeah, well, I don't really see it, but... Look at... Okay. But I'm doing it. And it sounds like Trevor would hit this bank for candy and a pat on the head. Now tell me, can we do it or do we move on? Now you can do it, but you can't do it clean. How messy we talk? Taking the cops head on messy. Well, they are dirty cops. That's what Trevor says. So do you think we can do it? Guys out here aren't trained like the LSPD. They aren't going to be prepared for a well-armed, well-drilled team coming straight for them. Yeah, well, we need an edge. Something to tip the odds in our favor. Yeah, I got a couple ideas. <laughs> All right. No! Okay, uh, I love that scream, by the way. That was amazing. Uh, I don't care if we win or not. I think he already made it. Yeah, he already made it. This car's not exactly built for Blaine County. Fifty miles an hour. Wow, their speedometers are really, their speed meters are. Trevor beat us here. Yeah, well, at least we weren't arrested. Damn. <laughs> he says, what took you so long? Had to let you win. <laughs> All right. Set up a board over here. Oh, Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're going to be making the wrong decisions. I mean, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Yo, bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a, a what? An eyelid. That's probably not even human. Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Ah, good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. Yeah. 
So I think our little uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. They'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice, choose someone good. You can choose a bunch of different people? Yeah. Think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. We could do that, but we're gonna choose Gustavo. He handled himself at the jewelry store. That it? You sure? Yeah. Confirm. That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want a bunk with us? I mean, it's gonna be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I, I'll get a motel, thanks. Well, that's what you Fine, I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Hmm? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh. 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 Healthy, huh, bud? Weird. New contact luster. Weird, huh? Polito score set up. Leisurely drive. I wasn't the winner though, but oh well. Alrighty. Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay. Well, it's got to be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael, and we'll come to you. T. Hey, man. All righty. That's the next Trevor mission. But we also got more Minutemen missions way up here in Polito Bay. Ah, uh, the good ones. All right, well, that's going to do it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to make sure you guys get my videos first. And as always, stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy. I've been the Liquid Gamer, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Good gaming.